Hey everyone, welcome again to 60 Seconds on Security. Today I'm going to talk real quickly about what I would consider the primary countermeasure. So we've talked a lot about uh, things that you can do to set yourself up uh, to be more secure. We've talked a lot about the idea of gathering critical information, the ideas of assessing vulnerability, and really the key to all of that, the primary key to all of that, is what I'll refer to and what other people refer to as situational awareness. So what is situational awareness? Situational awareness is paying attention to what's going on around you. Now with the just rapid, incredibly rapid increase of, or spread of, if you will, smartphones, tablets, and technology, uh, what we see today are a whole lot of people in advanced societies sitting down, staring at things, having no idea what's going on around them when they're out in public, when they're at the mall, when they're eating at restaurants, when they're traveling, whatever it might be, they're not paying any attention at all. They're just sitting around being victims. Now, by not paying attention, you can't do any assessments. You can't do any analysis of critical in the moment. You can't assess vulnerabilities. You can't assess threats if you're not paying attention to what's going on around you. Now, does this mean you need to walk around paranoid? Absolutely not. But it means that you're going to act and think in such a way that security is a primary function for you. Trust me, not everyone's going to do it. But you and I are. And that's going to be a better thing for the world in the end. Because eventually, when they're not paying attention and you are, and you basically go save them from their own stupidity or make them aware of a dangerous situation you're going to have done somebody a huge favor. So, out in public, put your phones away. Shut them off. Don't use your phones when you're driving. Don't text when you drive. Don't talk when you drive. Pay attention to what you're doing. Same thing applies. Walking around a mall, walking around in a shopping area, traveling to a strange country, getting yourself involved in a situation that you've never been into before. Look at where you are, look around, look for the danger spots, look for people that don't look like they're up to any good, and simply be aware. This then prepares you to deal with whatever may come your way. Situational awareness is huge, absolutely huge, and the first key for you in understanding and putting other countermeasures into place to protect yourself and your family your business, whatever it may be, as we always discuss. It's always all of these things. Foundational, again, situational awareness. Situational awareness, situational awareness. If you don't know what's going on with yourself, with your business, with your security, with the people that provide you services, you're not going to be ready. So it all comes down to this notion that we talked about earlier of a mindset. Now I'm saying the first countermeasure, pay attention. That's what situational awareness is all about. Paying attention to what's going on around you and in your business day to day. One last example. Think about something as simple as going to a restaurant you've never been to before. This will sound a little crazy to some of you, but this is still effective. Ask to sit somewhere where you can see the entire environment around you. Look for places where you can get out in an emergency. Just be aware. You don't have to go act on it. But when the time comes that something goes wrong, you're going to see it. You're going to know how to get out. You're going to know how to protect others. You're going to know what to do to react. How to take action on a countermeasure is all started with situational awareness. So that's all for today. As always, if you want to learn more, check out the videos down below, subscribe to the YouTube channel, uh, check out the website, Facebook page, whatever you want to, whichever way you want to interact with us, we'd love to hear from you. So, until next time, stay smart, stay aware, and secure, and safe. Thank you for watching.